but it does also appear like computer companies are struggling to sell anything at the current moment because new reports are coming out that the PC market has fallen 30% in the first quarter of 2023, which is a sharp drop, the sharpest in many, many years with a lot of companies suffering quite a bit. HP dropping 24%, Asus, Dell, Lenovo taking 30% cuts and Apple suffering the worst of all of them at 40%. However, it is being reported that this likely will not extend into the rest of the year. This is likely just a key Q1 issue, especially as people are waiting for M3 chips from Apple. And I can probably guess just in the gaming PC sector, a lot of people with the 30 series launched in, in 2020. So waiting until 2023 to buy that, like people are just waiting for the 40 series replacements for the 7,000 series replacements from AMD. There's a lot of waiting that's going on because we've been long in the tooth with what's currently out on the market. So I can see why this is potentially happening. We haven't had had a real reason to go out and buy new stuff in quite some time. The pandemic perfectly fueled the need to get a new PC for working from home and spending a lot more time around your computer. And then also really solid launches from all parties involved. Intel, AMD, Nvidia, Apple all came out with tremendous performers in so many different regards that it just, it made the upgrade cycle last a little longer. So I think probably later this year, next year, we should start seeing more people picking up computers because it's just, it's gonna be about that time, which is 